Hey, thanks for messing around. Vampire Survivors 290, whatever episode this is. It's Probo Texture Time with Moonlight Bolero. And we got Mago Impostorina. Illarizer and Ariana Spread Gun on Capella Magna. Like, one of only probably three groups that are going to take Capella Magna because, well, next video was the end of the fifth wave. Which is not good for my time management probabilities. Hi there, is this video starting so insanely late because I woke up late and just fell apart horribly today. Anyway, in the background, I'll be listening to Matara Khan of V Shoujo playing some more Space Marine 2. Uh, well, I watched more Cloud he play Space Marine 2 last night, or, well, I suppose it's two or three days ago now. By the time this goes up. Oh, I forgot to put back on wings. Well, I don't need maxed out wings, right? So I can just Armadillo it. Anyway, she's finally starting the search for Luz after getting a Thunderhawk crashed. Any landing you can wake away from, right? Shoot, shoot, shoot your sword, shoot your sword. Alright, she's testing out the chain sword moveset. It's a very nice balanced moveset. Stomp is my favorite move. Then you get that double stomp and uh, operations. Dun dun dun, yeah. Throw them swords. Oh boy. I think Megal Arena has been one of the single longest ones. I think actually, they've got... Hmm. Been in the most control videos, like, like three or... F like maybe even four. I don't think anyone has had two arenas. Megal Arenas, right? Well, either way, this is the end of it for sure. Ooh, it's the narrow throat part. That means things are about to get chaosy. The bugs are on the side of the walls and listening. Oh no! But we already knew that, didn't we, Matarcon? Didn't we? Kind of funny. Brother Valerius just gets ignored by everyone. Hey, the first group of three dudes, yeah, that makes sense to ignore them. They're barely there. Valerius actually sort of does a bunch of... Well, he doesn't do much of stuff, but he's got more impact than those three do. Game and practice your game and... Mori did pretty well getting attuned to it. But she lasts about as long as Matara did against the Carnifex. I can't believe I'm the guy who lasted the longest against the Carnifex at the start. It's really weird. Also, something I noticed uh, when playing Mori is that Titus is actually using the Grail Helmet. It's like... Uh, what is it? Mark 7 Helmet? The Aquila? Aquila? Well, the Primaris Helmet is Mark 10. Oh man, that's a lot of big bets. So yeah, that'll inevitably be up in the customization efforts, and hopefully the beaky isn't too far behind. Because what is an assault marine without a beak? Arbeen. Arby. Called a carbine a carpy. Was literally so sharp I thought it was he said harpy. Bugs don't do trench warfare. They're incapable of doing trench warfare. They just go in open warfare. I've seen ant wars. I've seen miles and miles of ant wars. It was huge and horrifying. Literally mounds and mounds of dead ant bodies. Higher than my hand if I placed it flat beside it. It was crazy. You could actually see it from like 10 feet away. It was so thick with fight. You'd think it was like a dirt streak at first, but no, it's ants. It's ants. Don't stop there, and they'll be all over your foot. Yes, Matara, we know how you are with shooting. And melee. Well, don't. You're gonna be taking five days off, but. That's just for streaming. Not from working. Don't say it's a day off. Say you're just going to be doing offline work. It's totally different.
Uh, I have so much more I need to do. I completely messed up the brake overlays for my streams. I really kind of need to make, like, one for each. Mm-hmm. Polaris! Polaris, my beloved! It's big sushi over pizza is their favorite food. Tut tut. What about that narrow throat? Barrier. Man, that's a lot of crab battle. Come on, Slum. No. It's not flirting. Space Marines can't flirt. They're incapable of having the drive to flirt. They are the perfect man, thus. Control your water content. Control your water content. Also, you could just say you're going on a break and say you need to pee. Tut tut. This is supposed to be a family friendly stream and recording. Well, at least she is drinking water. Boy, howdy, do I worry about others not drinking enough. Even I, who drinks so much, still thinks I'm drinking under. Alright, I need to go skip past by this ridiculous break. Oh man. Still no armadillo. And the Bolero hasn't dropped anything, so this eyeball is gonna give me my first Arcana. Jeez. That Bolero luck. Man, I didn't even max out on anything. Compensate. Alright, Ariana Spread Gun. He doesn't have a last name. That's why I just call her Spread Gun, because for some reason the Spread Gun video with her sort of has some of my most views. I don't know, YouTube gets weird like that. But not much in the way of likes or anything. It's a long, dopey series with not much commentary going on. Sword, 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 sword. Skip her giant break again. Alright, time to hunt down the Neurothrope in Space Marine 2. Ugh, I did some more scout off screen in Space Marine 2 just to try and get the carbine up, and man. So there's actually two different carbine types in the tree. One of them's like your basic SMG, and the other is like a snipery SMG, well, precision rifle. It does more damage and hits harder, but it's still not great. Well, granted, I am doing ruthless with green stuff, so. Not surprise I'm not doing much in the way of range damage. I'm trying to be melee and still failing orderly at that. Well, if you do get it going, it's pretty okay to be melee scout. Though obviously just the last few selling everything is gonna be much better use of your time. But hey, at least you have a build choice. At least there is a choice. Of course, if I was much better at the old whatchamacallits, perfect dodges, it'd be better. Since, you know, you got that damage boost for your breakout of cloak, and if you perfect dodge, you can get a cloak. If you spam that correctly, you can really punish something. Which, but the dodge frames and the perfect parry frames get worse. Oh. Yep, no health. That's no pass. Paralysis. Ah, Varelis. I don't know if Varelis comes back as a Dreadnought or anything. A lot of Probotector in. 
Oh yeah, those barb stringers are so annoying. I don't think anyone actually told her you can destroy the space pods or seed pods. No health. And then your sniper. Yeah, until you get in the groove, getting the gun strikes off with your melee. Just falling with your uh, armor apart is too too easy. There's been a lot of off-screen runs where I got really close to just going through a match without any health damage. Only to have some nonsense with a Carnifex or Zone Throw or something take me out. No, I mean, just by cowardice, I was trying to go in melee, hitting stuff. That cloak is good for disengaging. Some big piles of crates. Oh, I have support cry. That explains where all that damage is coming from. Yep, of course. Of course. Sucker. Sucker. And still no armadillo. Or another Arcana chest that showed up either. That's so annoying. What happens if it? Hmm. Drink your water, my Tarakan. Sip, sip, sup, sup. That's what break over laser for. I should probably, like. The suspicion, woo. Trust is necessary, but so is operational security. Ooh. There's a chest. That's actually not the Arcana chest either. Oh, they're friends if you're timing them out, Matarcon. Superior officer who's been reinstated and put in action two days after he was given surgery that should take the yeah, action for months. Oh, spread down it. Man, got so many armadillos so many other times. Well, maybe I'll actually remember to switch out over for it. On the other hand, he has been specifically put back in action by the chapter master, the boss of bosses. Relis charge. It's not a democracy, but if your commanding officer is going to do something illegal, then you have the legal right to stop him. You just probably won't have anything to do about it and sabotage your own career. You know, because all crap. Narrow throw open. Bring. Why would they be yours? You weren't throwing anything out. Why would the green circles from the narrow throw be yours? That tut, woman. That tut. I don't know. He lost a weapon and is now thinking about n not having it. The melt no more melt can still hit the narrow throat. Yeah, heck, that'll do the most damage against it. Short of a last fusel, and I don't even think that's in the campaign until a chaos comes up. Chaos. Why would the green stuff be yours? You've never seen it before. Northrop summons green stuff. Why would you... Oh, almost done. Almost done. 
At least know how to charge our plasma pistol. Jump through. Get through, get through. Roll, roll, roll into it. I mean, it's completely intuitive to somehow survive rolling into a giant sphere or dome. Dome. Expanding dome of energy wall. Melville's a really good guy against the neural throw. But at least it's not against a bloody zone throw. Heck, how did she miss that shot? Oh. Uh, no. Oh, wait, no, is she thinking about the... Oh, it must be another one of the... Stalker variants that... Or the carbine that has the scope variant. I guess I could call it the carbine stalker, but that's also a different weapon entirely. Eh. No, no. That's so counterintuitive to roll through it. Because all of the hit detection on it is awkward. Like in the Dark Souls. Just roll through it. Pump that leg. Then you'll win. Wow, that's far up there. Bamboozled. Yep, once more Stalker shows up to ruin everything. Still no armadillo. 28 minutes in, no armadillo. No extra arcana chest. Well, no, wait, one extra arcana chest, but it was right before the second one was about to show up anyway. I don't even know what happens to it in that circumstance if I make sure I got on the other arcana chest. Sword, 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 sword. Information is power, guard it well. Or no, knowledge is power, guard it well. So saith the blood ravens. Huh? Oh, death. Death and full, death and full. 17, 2, 1, 3. Time for some real action in Dark Souls. Probotector, Bill Bean. Ariana Spread Gun and Sheena Etronzi. And we get a spread shot, woo. Alright, let's go grab my stuff. Oh, it's not the top ones. Uh, you're not Empty Tome. Where are you, Empty Tome? Okay. Gotta get both of you. And everyone else can grab whatever. It doesn't matter. Alright, in the background, I'm listening to Matar Khan play Space Screen 2. She is currently fighting the Neurothrope and having quite a bit of trouble about it because she is not used to this type of thing. And she... Well... Alright, I can still grab stuff. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what you do or say. Uh, those are all things I'm going to pick up. Yeah, go figure. And of course, I got Vento Sacro. Oh boy, this is going to be annoying getting rid of this eye. Well, send out as many prism last flashes as I can. Boy, those eyeballs are annoying. Oh, rapid fire. That helps considerably. Snakes. Why are snakes doing damage? They're snakes. They barely exist. The enemy. Why is that eyeball bigger? Oh, grenade. Oh, well, that was solved by everything much earlier. Armor on bean. Might's good. Armor's good. A lot of nice gems pick up. Should be for a level. Another one down. The other two are not much of a threat. 
Okay. Yeah, she's still struggling through it. Oh man, she's not even at half health. Yeah, it's troublesome for her. She has a melt up, but she's trying to keep it range instead of getting close to the thing. I want its moveset. I know that's a strange idea, but that's just that first time. I don't know what to do, kind of. Caution. Why is it not shooting out in the direction I moved? Alright, there we go. More spread gun action. Man, I'm tired. Or blade crossbow. Yeah, at least I'm streaming. That's the only thing keeping me going right now. Oh, bo, 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 bo. Oh, bo, 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 bo. Should have saved that grenade for the uh, plant things. And of course, no Arcana Golems. Why would I want the most useful one of them all? Definitely want to try and hold out for getting the time warp off a chest. Unless you know what to do. Yeah, but... Of course, once you realize what to do and what to say, everything's going to be easier. That's sort of every game ever. Move out. Melt to everything. Where... Where are you at, Arcana Chest? Take the merge, Cadians! Where the heck did it go? I saw it. Where does it go? There it is. There we go. Take care of this jerk thing. Oh, she took out that neural throat. And the Cadians are ready to advance and kick some Tyranid out of the city. Wonder where the local PDF and guard chapter is. Yep. Oh, big chesto. Oh, it's Carmelta. I did my max damage with a Vanguard with only base Gray Melta. Where is that Arcana chest at? It's all the way down here, jeez. Oh, it's too far away. It died just off camera. Lamo. Lamo. Well, there's the other Arcana. I mean, if I could mad groove off it. There's a molasses upgraded. I have wings. So it has to be maxed out wings, which is not good. Grab battle. Grab battle. Oh, if only I could move the others. Try and clear them out for some damage, but... Hey, Matara, did you know you could charge a plasma pistol? No. Oh, hey, water. It's time for me to drink water. In the middle of this... ...recording. Yummy, delicious water, and I nearly died to nonsense because I just took my thing off from it. Why are they so strangely durable? Stop swearing, my ears, my ears can't take it. My ears also keep messing up.
Go in, go in. If you don't know ammo, melee is the only option. Why do they carry so few rounds? Well, let's... Oh, that one isn't the chest. Oh man, they're both... They're all huge. Another Bolero with no real benefit to me. I mean, more stuff is nice, but it's not more Arcanas. Oh, loop time. Time warp? No, I'm not getting any time warps. Oh, who needs time warp, you know? It's just one of the evolutions around. Another one dead. Hurry, hurry. Get to the dome. Cutscene. And victory. 800, 68, 102. Well, they were mostly down, so not a surprise. It's time for Moonlight Bolero and me being really long to do this because, well, whatever. Robotector, Stanley, New Pliskin, and Colonel Bahamut. The final row, full row, is on Green Acres. Woo. Woohoo. Matara Khan, on the background, playing Space Marine 2. I'm reacting to her. You just beat up the Neurothrope, got the cutscenes after that, and is about to fall into things. Oh, uh. Rodan! Hi, Rodan. Wait, actually, is it Rodan? Yeah, it is flat out Rodan. Thought maybe it might have been Radon, and I just switched it, but it's full on Rodan. Oh, duplicator. Idiot duplicator. Captain Fairburn, where are you at, my man? Aurelis. It's really... Uh, I know the Marines are more prestigious, but there are different branches. They shouldn't be giving orders to guardsmen. Uh, you can actually get Rodan's helmet. Or, no, not Rodan's. He's guard. You can get Aurelis' helmet, but it's on the DLC pack. Is annoying because it's neat. Getting that stripe. Ambush. Boom. No! Frankly, the fact that it kills Varelis. It's awkward. Not that big of an explosion. Squish goes the guardsman. It's time for chaos! Thousand Sons! You recognize them on sight. Traitors and heretics. Magnus. Gonna be a tragedy. And a power broker. Traitors, the Kalf heresy. Turn to dust. Turn a dist. Tearing them up. It's actually kind of impressive just how different each class has to actually fight their rubrics. Sniper just annihilates through them, but Bulwark kind of has some trouble. So all they have is melee. And melee is kind of not easy to deal with because the flamer ones just have two dodge attacks with awkward timings. Come out pretty fast. Well, one of them is fast, the other is slow, but the slow one hits like a truck and is a really bad dodge setup. And the perfect dodge, you have to double dodge, and if you don't double dodge fast enough, you'll still get hit. Oh, no. No sorcerer yet. 
I still have yet to see any of those greater sorcerers in operations. Could a uh, page I'm looking at be lying to me? Chaos! Space Marines are everywhere. Yep, that memory works. They're gonna teleport. Mint has a grandmother. Why are you going to someone else's house for Thanksgiving? Ew. Woohoo, dust marines, go. Yeah, a little burst of super moving. Oh, actually, I could go out of bounds, Conan I. Or, no, I could go, uh, deal a crystal and then out of bounds. Uh, I have Clock Lance it. I'm probably not going to be able to get... Oh, wait, no, they have three unavoidable attacks. Oh, a regular, uh, Inferno rubric. Inferno? Well, the Inferno Bolter rubric has one. The Flamer ones have three. They have an unavoidable stop, an unavoidable fire burst, and an unavoidable fire circle. Heretic Astartes and Chaos Heretics. Just walking. Gotta save Luz from them heretics. Can't let the ruinous powers win. I never played Bioshock like she said. Yoink, grab that plasma pistol. Ooh, get a little... Getting close to a last pistol. Go up that glowy blue thing. That okay, stins. With long nails, that seems counterintuitive. The F and the G, huh? Wait, did she say mid or mint? Chaos! Corruption. Oh yeah, there was that System Shock remake over there. Still haven't read any news on System Shock 3 stuff coming out, but that's not a surprise. Kieran, go! Destroy the Chaos Heretics! Man, that bit's a big mantis. Oh, no future. Ten minutes in, not bad. A random. Ooh, big shopping. Big sister and big daddy. Huh. Or Bioshock. Why was it big sister instead of big mommy? Odd. Huh. Oh, yeah, I care on. You were better than player AR, care on. In this segment. Hey, uh, Kana. Zangors! Zangor! Just to pick up O. Oh, Seder. That's. That makes a lot more sense. Wait, I still. Still don't have bloody time warp, huh? And I have Clock Lancet too with it, so that's neat. And, well, no future will get the benefit from Jail of Crystal too. That's actually very helpful to pick up. I mean, if you get out of bounds, it's usually going to be extraordinarily helpful. Best Arcana's around. Now that I think about it, I probably should have gotten... Wings on the character I'm controlling if I had choice of it. Huh. Engage. Nope, she is almost to where the last fusel is. 
wonder if she'll grab it or she'll just stick them out there. My S Fusil is my favorite weapon by quite a bit. Venom roof, they had Venom Cannon. It's so annoying. It doesn't help out the hit detection on it's a bit wonky, so where they're aiming isn't actually where the shot will hit. A lot of time with that and the chaos. Uh, chaos heretic sniper. Chaos heretic sniper. Can't be easy to fall off the gimmick there. We're gonna get some chaos in here. I'm getting multiple evolutions. Huh. Actually, I can. Both the Probo Tectus weapons are gonna upgrade off of the wings, huh? Uh, Stanley is second. Why is he at the bottom? Okay. Time warp. Thunder Looper, really? <laughs> oh, son. Easy. Last fusel. Yep, fire that. There we go. Time warp. And uh, Celestial Bulge. Bulge is irrelevant. It's all about the time warp. Wow, that took forever to fire without. Oh, I also saw a thing about how ridiculous the headshot damage for the last fusel is, and it's like times 14 in total. It explains so much about why it's two type of things in Execute. Have words with Karen. Have words. Many angry words. As a gray shield for ya. Chest. Right now. I don't think they ever actually call in out of an apothecary to retrieve Polaris's gene seed, huh? Frankly, I talk about him at all after. Hey, it's a chest. Uh, it's Newt's time to shine. It does benefit me somewhat, but time warp does it naturally. So I'll take Sound Old Sanctuary first. Make sure that I can always freeze things. Head, head, head. Go for the headshot. And granted, the headshot's going to be a bit awkward. Am I the problem? Well, if you're someone who leaves shopping carts out, yes, you are the problem, and you are 100% wrong, and always in the wrong, and will always be in the wrong. You have the title of, yes, you are the problem. For all eternity. There's nothing you can do to convince me otherwise. God, I loathed it when... I had to go with people to grocery stores. I would return the carts every time, and they would look at me like, Why do you return the carts? And I'm like, Screw you! Why don't you return the carts, you prick? And it's insane. The five seconds it's, like, heck, at most a minute it takes me to return the cart is not going to destroy your life. If it helps make someone else's day less miserable, then heck yeah. I don't care about you, you miserable prick. Destroy the eyeball. Like heck, even just as I was coming home from a walk earlier today, car going down the block just drops a styrofoam cup in the middle of the road. 
If I just noticed it earlier, I probably would have shouted and called them a swear word. Well, by the time I noticed that it actually happened, they were halfway down the road. I got nothing to lose at this point. Oh, huh, no chest. How can you die? What you kill? Right, how about that? Your duty is to the Emperor. You're the wife, Matara. No, you don't. <laughs> Aaron's 10,000 years old. And kids are freaking out because they've dealt with the situation before, so they have the experience. So it's their true emotion. Meanwhile, we had all just bury everything down in order to not cause a scene. Because our perception of other people is more important than our actual true feelings. Chaos. When you're dealing with chaos, nothing is as it seems. What? Oh, I never saw a thing when a statue either. Why would you look up? There's nothing good looking up. Just a sky about to fall on you. Also, have I not had a bloody comer? I haven't had a single ad on this video while I was getting slammed with endless ads last time. Bolt gun. Well, yeah, it is. Bolt gun is a boomer shooter. Yeah, if you're not used to old graphics, it can be a problem. I read something that Final Fantasy IV was originally supposed to be at NES, and I just don't see it. The graphic overhaul. Yeah, it's just, you're not going to get that on the NES. Cecil alone, I think, has more pixels than the entire screen. And heck, Final Fantasy File was basically the same. It was barely an upgrade. Wait. Someone also posted a screenshot of Final Fantasy 7 OG. Wow, I have to actually specify that. And Final Fantasy 10 only being like four years apart. And now that I think, you know, I think they used the HD patch for the Final Fantasy X screenshot. Which means that no, it's not what X looked like, it's what very specific cutscenes looked like when it came out. And not the whole game at all times. I mean, if you're gonna use that, you might as well use X's full, or 7's full cutscenes. In comparison sort of true, but also misleading, which is, well, how most things go. Oh, right, it's 30 minutes. Victory. Bulge. Six, six, seven. At least I got time warp that time. Time for some boss rash with Probotector, Sheena Thronzi, Newt Pliskin, and Colonel Bahamut. Silent Old Sanctuary, because Bolero isn't really going to be helpful. Matara Khan, space read in the background. Find some lesser chaos sorcerer. Or wait, no, that's wrong. Lesser chaos sorcerer. And she's lagging and falling. Woo. Totally not her fault she died. Just like every time it's not my fault I die, it's the game being bad. Go figure. Oh, I still have no idea how I'm supposed to have to beat Sora and the idol thing with the idol song. 
an idle showdown. Why are they not exploding? Oh man, spell string. That's like one of the worst weapons I could have gotten. Uh, fires pretty quickly, but... Oh, it's not a full boss. He's extremist. Well, actually, the Lector was extremist, too, but... It got a boss fight. Because uh, it was an Alpha Lector. Which kind of, sort of, exists. Eh. Roll into it. Smash them all. Uh, I have to go Crystal Cry for the next... Man, I don't have the arsenal to take care of this. Red stuff? I don't think the red stuff does anything. I can't see either of my tar. That's because I have OBS up. Boy, not having... Red, red stuff. I don't know what she's talking about. I mean, I know Flamer stuff is red, but... Uh... And these things are so durable. Uh. Oh, and I've got cats, really? Hmm. I'm not even sure if Space Marines with multiplayer is still up. What? Chaos got appreciator down with the heretic. We gotta stop chaos wherever it comes. Don't look that dried up with all that water you're drinking. Oh boy, they're coming on fast. A vacuum, that's helpful, but not great. I don't know what day their about is for this. Yeah, the first one was 27, so this might be the 28th of the 29th or heck even longer. Could have been in October even. Oh, I'm trying to hope for a grenade or a rosary. No more Tyranids. No more Tyranids. Oh, dang it. I mean, helpful, but not great. I, mean, I was trying to save it for the Reapers. Sometimes you just gotta push on through. At least they're both not helpful and all very helpful. As boy, is it annoying to get in through them. Ah, uh, this is ending poorly for me. No more one. Oh, I was really hoping for more anything. Oh, I can't evolve, so there's that. There's Ender. Boy, could I use some Mad Groove to get anything helpful. Don't get big, Ender. Oh, this is not ending well. Arcana. I have to actually get Mad Groove here, because I need to wipe them out. Rosary is here. 
got a... Oh man, I took way too much damage. There we go. Time warp. And that should finish me. Or let me finish this. Uh, where was it? Prize. And I just grab everything I can. Boy, am I weak and pathetic. I think that's the only time I've ever seen a time warp with like two layers instead of 50 billion. Okay, I actually need to let myself get low. And then I can use the hearts to heal up. That was one of theirs. Heal up off of. What's with that? Good. Yeah, this is pathetic. <laughs> Wait. Oh, right, you're all being defanged. That's... Oh. It's only when time warp is up, though. Didn't know that. It's not exactly... Most things aren't exactly going to survive that much time warp. Discard. Test. Boom. Yay, town. You're not, not fighting the greatest of the lords of change. Reason. They teleport behind you because that's what they just do. They teleport. Snakes on a plane. Okay, that movie was actually fine. I don't know why anyone was down on it. One mil. Yeah, that's. We aren't going to be fighting Kairos, really. Stop it. Thanks for messing around in the final section with Probotector. We got Stanley, Newt Pliskin, and Colonel Bahamut. And yep, that leaves Samundu Belmundu as the character I'm playing for the last one. I'm still listening to Matara Complex Space Marine 2, and I got confused. Arrow's Fate Weaver is not the most powerful Lord of Chains. That's. Uh, actually, what is his name? Okay, the most powerful of the Lords of Change is Ateos Raukeras, who's the, one of the most expensive units on the tabletop. Like, more expensive. Uh, like, he's 1,500 points when armies cost 2,000. So, if you bring him in, people are not going to like you. Heck, I think that's more than Primarchs cost. And Primarchs are godly. They're basically demigods. Anyway. He has just rescued Luz and is having some drama with regards to Project Aurora. Surely nothing will come from that. Okay. Doubt. Doubt. Prism last. Right next is. Oh wait, no. There should be some nids on the next fight too, shouldn't it there? Huh. Nids actually have more of a. Three of the operations are dedicated to nids, and the seventh one is going to be nid two. And then they're half and half on the third operation. They have more presence. is interesting. 
But he still can last for you, so a warrior. It is harder than a Rubik, because warriors can jump around a bit more. Dodge! Huh, the missiles fire out weirdly if they go down fire in them, huh? Oh, I need to bring you. Uh, I need to try and draw you out here so you don't hit Stanley. Yeah, there we go. Sword. Woo. Alright, now let's get this big pink blobby thing. Oh man, more of them. Try to so toss the... Oh good, we can push you away. Or no need to. Ooh, chest. Uh, health, yeah, let's get some health. There's actually more enemies than I was expecting for Space 54. Usually it's somewhat empty. Ooh, goody. Goody Arcana. I have whip. I have whip. I got Arcana. Touch the button, Matara. Touch the button, Matara. Touch it, touch it, touch it. We need you to touch the button. If you don't touch the button, the world will fall apart. Battle Barge. More talking with good old Acheron. Making the plan for the second operations. Spoilies. Don't spoil. Don't spoil for people. So many people were spoiling Moi for Dark Souls 3, and they're so annoying. Thankfully, they held it back more for Space Marine 2. There are multiple high cities on Avax, okay. And then we're attacking another one in Ballistic Engine. Man, that's a lot of radar good. Well, what their plans are is considerable good use of force. Oh, that's not good. Yay, more cooldown reduction. Nerds. Huh, it is interesting. Too bad. It's not a fight. Ugh. But whoever is she. Six man. And yet they don't count. They just squad as one of them. It's weird like that. Also, as I've seen, the force projection charts kind of against. Okay, good. I'm broken free. Uh, different from what appears when you get to the actual mission. No, they have faces. That means they're all gonna live. legal reasons.
Good grief. Well, I suppose own is important. I mean, obviously it always sounds like a joke, but... If someone makes a joke enough, you can't worry they're being serious about it, even if they keep talking about a jokey. Jericus. Oh, those dang left hands. So hard. Old scores against guys who are older than you. Or did it Leave that sword. Varellis. And then Varelis is never mentioned again. <laughs> uh, maybe he gets secretly and turned into Dreadnought. Gossip. I mean, no, it's got to be getting darker. Oh, man. Uh, cheer up, love. No. <laughs> what bad taste. Deflin. Hey, a chest. Oh, time warp. Neat. Ooh, full screen. Dive of mine. Yeah, they were definitely not moving like this beforehand when I was nuding first, though. Must have been patched in with the bats, bats, bats. That and multi stage. Or that and the missiles. Speaking of them, boom. Missiles in space! I know it looks bad, but it's even worse than you imagine. Destroy! Destroy the Drowner! Is there a rosary or a grenade around here? Oh, uh, there's a bloody tear in space. Uh, actually, isn't there a rosary on the map? Oh, no, wait, it's me. Or, it's Probotector. Uh, so I can mad groove uh, it over. It is here. Yeah. I'll take care of yous. Alright, Phaser, too. Wait, is she seriously only a year old? Oh, good grief. He's got more subs than I have S subs. Well, not a surprise. What was that? Oh, it's Discord. It's my Discord, not hers. Well, only a few seconds left to go. And then it's time to head out and do some other stuff. But Samuda's coming up next. And that'll be really awkward because of how it's devolved. But hey, I'll shove what I need to to get it done. There's got to be some array of these characters. To win. Right? Right? Right?
Two mil, three, one, two. Okay, and that is another 20 down on the Vampire Survivors Beswick. Bringing us up to 1,289 complete and a total of 669, 666 to go. Beastly. Next up, it's going to be Simondo, and he's going to be finishing up the fifth wave, as well as finishing up everyone who hasn't finished. Actually, going to probably dip down to three characters, but hey, it's done, it's done, and after that, it's the Yomalise Nightmare Run. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Please like, dislike, comment, or subscribe if you haven't. The support keeps me going, and thank you anyone who has. Either way, I hope you have a good day, and you keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.